Martin Lupa. Uh, they do have a good number of supporters here as well, but uh, this is pro Martin Lupa. Majority of them. This is like a championship atmosphere filled to the rafters. Ang dami nga dito, nakatayo na lang kasi wala na maupuan eh. There's a foul on Altamirano against Jello Rason. Just the second team foul on uh, Muntinlupa. For, for, for those who have been following the MPBL since season one, uh, the, these two teams have a long history because they played actually for a spot, na, uh, a spot in the finals of the MPBL. And it was uh, Mutinupa who uh, qualified for the national finals against Batangas where they fell short. No? So, may history tong dalawang team na to. And you can see early on that they really are battling it out hard. Kaya lang Mutinupa, a number of defensive stops in Paranaque, just having a hard time offensively. Jello Razon there by Ichi Altamirano defensively. Yeah, it's clearly a foul, pero <laughs> kinabahan ako dun eh, kasi nag <laughs> hiniwalay sila ng referee, wala naman nangyayari. <laughs> Alright, but it's just a regular foul right there. And it's gonna be a warning. He was already teed up earlier. Yeah, that's correct. For a different, um, Re uh, reason that's why uh, ito warning muna First technical foul on number 99 Jello Razon Okay so that was the second technical foul of Jello Razon therefore he is now out That is going to be the second technical already on Jello Razon so natuluyan na nga ng technical And that's why nagtataka ako na <laughs> kanina that you know that was the second you can't warn him because not, he is already was already teed up earlier. So our referees correcting themselves right there. And General Razon, two technicals, so he's out of the ball game. And Coach Mike Sagigit having a headache early on. Oh, the, the, our former co our colleague, 